Hey guys, so today that comment for today is you're the nothing when people ask me what I'm thinking about. So today we're gonna do like a makeup tutorial kind of thing. You're kind of far up there. There you go. All right, so this is gonna be kind of more of a softer kind of nice thing. It's like the if I'm running late or I don't know exactly what I want to do for my makeup, it's like my my go-to makeup. So we're gonna start by priming a face, and I'm using this uh, eight hour hour eight hour lasting finish. Um, by Remel, it's really good. So you're just gonna put that on your face, like so. All right. Then there's that. Then you're gonna put on your foundation. However, you put on your foundation, I'm gonna be using the um, Born This Way porcelain, and I'm gonna be using my makeup spongy thingy. So just just put on your foundation. We'll be right back. All right, now that I got my face all covered in foundation, you're gonna take um, just a concealer. I have this Elf concealer, and you're just gonna take that under your eye area. I like to do a little bit kind of dramatic kind of take away my dark circles you're just gonna do that under the eyes and we're gonna do it along the bridge of your nose kind of up here over your eyebrows I don't think you're gonna be able to see it too terribly well because I'm sitting right in front of a window and it's kind of bright but this just really helps uh, make you look not tired because I did not sleep for very long today so we gotta make sure that we look like we did sleep really long today all right so you're just gonna take that make sure that's all blended in gotta take my little mirror here just make sure that's all blended with your beauty blender or whatever you're using there's no rules to makeup all right then after you have completed that I'm going to go in with some contouring I've got um Too Faced uh, milk chocolate bronzer it it smells so good. I love it. It's my favorite thing ever. Um, I'm going to take that on my blue, blue, beauty blender. Make some weird faces. Get that contour line. It's hard to do this in front of a window. There's too much light. Alright. Then we got that going there. Get some going across here. Some cover that up underneath here get some more up along here up over here this area all right a little bit more here and then I'm ah, gonna pinch my finger and I'm just gonna take my brush I'm just gonna blend that out really nicely I'm just gonna make sure that I don't have this harsh crazy line all over my face so I'm gonna I'm gonna finish with the blending and we will be right back now that we've got that blended up pretty nicely you can contour your nose if you'd like to um, I do that by taking the very tip of my beauty blender putting it in there I've, I've got to use the mirror for this but just going along the side whoops, of your nose and kind of up into your brow area it's gonna look a little harsh at first and then you just do that on the other side like so I don't know if you're going to be able to see how harsh that line looks right now but then you're just going to take a brush like this one and you're just going to blend that out and it is going to look a lot more natural blend this all out here And there you go with that looking pretty good there and then the next thing that we're gonna do here is we're going to start going in our eye area finally and I'm gonna be taking this elf um, primer and line sealer but just using the, the eye primer side and I'm going to get my mirror again and we are gonna put this on our eyes right here get everything all primed and ready 
I also like using this one because um, it's not the exact color of my foundation. It's a little bit brighter, so it kind of um, brightens up my eye area as well. And we're going to blend that all out. Get a nice good base for our eyeshadow. And then for eyeshadow, the first thing that we're going to go in with is I'm going to take this um this brush. It's from like my very first ever Tarte palette, and I just am in love with it. And this this end of it, it's kind of like a a round thingy. It's perfect for what I'm about to be doing here. So I do this with um either of these two shades. They are both um the Elf Long Lasting Lustrous Eyeshadow. I think I'm probably gonna do the darker color today. And um, it's like a little pot that's got like a it's in between like a gel and a powder it's it's really hard to explain but I just you know spin my brush in there get some product on there and it's not gonna really look like there's much on there but I can assure you there's these are magic you can probably do most of the look that I did today with elf I mean most of the things I have for elf I have things all the way down from elf all the way up to like you know Too Faced and all that fun jazz so it's mostly an elf look and then um the reason that this brush is so nice is because i just put it in the corner twirl it a little bit go up into my crease area and blend this out i need my mirror all right here we go i'm gonna take this i'm gonna blend it out Kind of get it a little all over there. Alright. Kind of like this. I'm going to blend it out a little bit more. We'll be right back. Now that we've got that blended out nicely, I'm going to take this uh, Sephora Dual Reflex and Iridescent Shell. It's like a, a glitter. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. And I'm just going to take that and put that all over my lid. Like so. And we'll be right back. Now that that has blended out nicely, we're going to take just an eyeliner pen and just do your eyeliner the way that you regularly do your eyeliner. You can wing it or not, whatever works for you. Now that we've got that done, wow, you can really see how blonde my eyelashes are. But I'm going to take this Ulta, oh, it says gel eyeliner, no wonder it's so wonderful. Anyway, I'm going to take this and I'm going to do the waterline, but I don't go all the way across, I just do like... This little part right there, and I'm going to do that along the other side as well, like so, so it's not all the way across, and I will be right back, I'm just going to fix that up with my mirror. Alright, now I'm going to go in with my um, mascara, I start with the Ulta Twisted Lumen Volume thingy, and then I, this is all scratched, you can't see, but it's the um, CoverGirl Waterproof. But I start with this first, so I'm going to apply that real quick. Okay, so my camera's running out of time, but I did my eyebrows after I finished my mascara. I put on just a little bit of highlight, and I just kind of, you know, finished up my mascara nicely. And now I'm going to take my finishing powder and set all of this. And then that is just going to be the completed look. It's just kind of a nice, soft, subtle, but still, you're wearing makeup kind of look. It's probably my favorite so um leave a like if you like these kinds of videos uh comment down below if you want to see something else and that that's pretty much it guys this is the look i put a little bit of um shimmer in the inner corners of my eyes as well and that that's it so see you guys